Hey everyone. It's our last few days in Nashville. Yeah, um, the trip is coming to an end, um, but we still got, today is Thursday. We still it's have- It's Wednesday. To, what? Yeah. Okay, it's Wednesday. I just cut all this out. Um, hey everyone. Hey everybody. <laughs> We're going to Restoration Hardware right now to check it out in Nashville and then um, might get some Korean food for dinner and we're going to spend our last few days checking out Music Row feet. Turn right on and the what's left of downtown ourselves. that we haven't seen yet. Yep. Do you like this place? It's really nice. We're going furniture shopping. Not really. More like furniture browsing. Or aspirational furniture shopping. Dream shopping. The price tag is so complicated, he can't even understand it. He can't even read it. It's just the bay. The duvet is $500. That's not terrible. I'm cutting that out of the video. <laughs> Wait, sit on it. How much is the mattress? Sunubu. It's like seafoody. Very good. There's a lot of seafood in here. A lot of mini seafood. Um, our side dishes are fish cake, kimchi, an egg omelet, I believe, bean sprouts, cucumbers, radish, and potato. And we also got kimbap. It has hot dog, I think, egg, radish, pickled radish, and it's really proud and carrot. It's very good. I'm surprised. I don't usually like hot dog, but it's pretty good. Nice. Yum. Mm. The skin of it is a little bit more oily. It's kind of like dim bop. You know in Korea, the little hand rolls? No. Well, if you know, you know what I'm talking about. And then we have just beef bones here. Yep. Very good. How's your soup? Kabi tang is very peppery, but it's really good. Oh, your lips are so red. It looks like you're egg lipstick. Really? Yeah. Why? I think it's just in this video. Oh.
trying to use Uzbekistan food. Restaurant is called Osh Restaurant and Grill. He's been wanting to come here for the past four days. Never had Uzbekistan food. So, we'll Menus see. are huge. They gave us some pita bread. Let's see how this is. We got this thing called a logma. Logman. Logman? Yeah. <laughs> and they give us some hot sauce. And hot sauce? Oh, this is the soup dish you ordered. Yeah, this is soup okay. dish. He's trying the hot sauce. Mmm. Wow, that's really fragrant. This is so good. And we don't know what's in it, but it's good. It's a little spicy. Roasted wow. peppers. If I could buy that, I would. You probably can. Yeah. And then so this is a logman. It's like looks like noodles, tomato-based broth, some peppers, dill, green beans, and let's see what kind of meat this is. It's beef. It doesn't taste gamey as beef. Yeah, so let's try a mix of it. Ooh, yes. I wonder if these are hand pulled noodles. <laughs> Hanzo hand pulled noodles? Mm. It's Uzbekistan food, so it's not that far from Asia. Yeah. Let's try this out. Oh, wow. It's really long. Smells like vinegar. Yes, that's vinegar. Try the noodles. Mm. What is it like? It's good noodles. I mean, I think it tastes homemade. It's good. Very simple. Yeah, it's a very light broth, light tomato broth. I know it's homemade because these noodles don't come that long if it's like. Oh, yeah, yeah, right? true. Good yeah. point. But yeah, homemade light tomato broth. Very good. Nice. So the noodles taste like, it's kind of like beef and tomato soup, like Asian beef and tomato soup, yeah. um, but with dill. It's really good. Yeah. With handmade noodles and then a Greek salad, and we all know what a Greek salad tastes like. Mm -hmm. We also got mixed grill and osh. Looks like there's peppers, carrots, raisins, and lamb and a quail egg on top. The osh is a little gamey, but if you like lamb, I think it'll be good. So the lamb's not, the lamb tastes good. Like it's not gamey at all. Oh. Sorry to For non-lamb lovers. For non-lamb lovers, okay, yeah. It's, lamb's always it tastes like taste, lamb, it tastes like yeah, lamb. Yeah, it's always gonna taste gamey, but for lamb lovers, uh, this is perfect. It's so good. Um, a little bit of, there's a quail egg. It's like seasoned rice, carrots. Um, there's a little bit of raisins. I think it's a traditional Uzbekistan dish. Very good. All done, mostly. Woo. How is this place? Very good. Did not expect to eat Uzbekis, Uzbekis food in Nashville. Um, it's kind of random. I found it on Google. And uh, yeah, it was really good. But yeah, would recommend. I'd give this place eight and a half. I think that's good. Eight and a half. What would you give the lamb itself? Just the lamb. Nine and a half out of ten. That was Damn. so damn good lamb. Like no gaminess whatsoever. Very juicy and seasoned very well. I mean, can't really get much better.